The EU will struggle to cope without the UK as the bloc will become more politically fragmented without Britain's presence. A research paper suggested the EU's single market commissioner, Thierry Breton, claimed Brexit has weakened and isolated the UK. Any concrete benefits for Britain are hard to see, Mr Breton said, while the pandemic has exposed even further downsides of a UK outside a collective bloc. His comments come five years on from the historic vote in 2016 which saw 52% of Britons make their disdain for Brussels heard. The UK wouldn't leave the EU for another four years, however. Only at the turn of 2021 did the country officially exit the Single Market and Customs Union. While many hailed it as a victory for Britain, Mr Breton, talking to The Guardian, said the promises made by Brexit campaigners were far from reality as the two powers build a new relationship. Yet, myriad reports and studies paint a bleak picture for the EU. In a paper published by the Centre for European Reform, CER, in 2019, it was suggested that the bloc will become more politically fragmented post-Brexit. This was in part, it said, because the European Commission and Parliament will be less likely to reflect British ways of thinking and working. The report said, the new European Parliament will be more politically fragmented and less likely to back freer trade with third countries and market liberalisation internally. It did note, however, that this would not be a direct result of Brexit, but because of the evolution of politics in the EU, yet, it added, the departure of British MEPs from the European Parliament will, however, reinforce this trend. Conservative and Labour MEPs often worked hand-in-hand hand to support economically liberal policies. Populist parties, more supportive of protectionist policies, are expected to do well in the May European Parliament elections. Such parties are also likely to benefit disproportionately from the redistribution of 27 of the UK's current seats among the remaining member states. 